Well, great morning, everyone. It's uh, early. I went to bed really early last evening because I didn't sleep the night before, you know, worrying about uh, getting up in time for the appointment, etc. And, um, you know, Miss Lily was came back and was hurting yesterday. Now, uh, she's great this morning, okay? Um, and I went to give her her, her her pill, pain pill, and Mickey ate it instead. Mickey, Mickey took her pain pill. I put it in a piece of cheese. She spit it out. He, he snagged it, so Mr. Mickey will be feeling no pain today. <clears throat> but it's, you know, Miss Lily's acting like she really doesn't need it anyway, which is good. Um, <clears throat> she's been up and down off the bed numerous times. Now I have to pick her up and put her down, you know, but that's always been the case. But she went outside, went, went potty, did, you know, good girl thing. She's gone up and down the stairs here um, to the couch. And so she's doing really well. Um, she's back to her self again. Yesterday, she was really out of sorts and just did not want anybody to come near her, <laughs> which I understand. I've been there. <laughs> it, it's a painful procedure. <clears throat> Basically, I had the same thing done, you know, years ago, but, uh, you know, and it, it can be painful healing, okay? Uh in my case, they thought that I had cancer, and they do the hysterectomy and then find out, oh, there's nothing there. You was you were quite healthy, okay? But it does take you know time to heal up uh, from from that. So anyway, she's doing really well this morning. Um, yeah, we can actually hit the road. Because uh, in the car doing the traveling, you're, she's not, you know, moving around. Um, she's not moving around a lot. And uh, so I think we would be actually fine to take off and hit the road. So um, <clears throat> that is what I'm contemplating today. I don't have anything being delivered. Uh, I canceled that doctor's appointment, so I don't go in until May. So um, on that note, I'm kind of uh, looking at uh, hitting the road, although I just saw on the Internet, it looks like there's going to be huge storms they're predicting coming through the south here. So... Uh, uh, I'm going to have to check on that and see uh, what's going on. I do want to go over to Roswell again because I told them I would give them my book at the Roswell UFO thing um, for their library. So I want to go drop that off. And there are a number of the state parks that I've never been to here in New Mexico that are on that side of New Mexico, so I was thinking about maybe going that direction and hitting those parks. Now, remember last time I went, I woke up to 19 degree weather and snow and snow flurries <laughs> over there in that that area. Uh, um, so <clears throat> we'll see. It's still in the stage of. Um, should I go and what? Should I pack? How long do I think I will remain out, etc.? So that's where it's at today. Anyway, um, it looks like a deck that I had pre ordered months and months and months ago is done, and they're going to get that sent out. Of course, now that I'm ready to hit the road, there may be something coming in, and when it's coming in, I don't know. So I have to see about that. But other than that, uh, mainly I just wanted to let everybody know 
Thank you for all the prayers and well wishes. Miss Lily is doing great this morning. Uh, she really doesn't need the pain pill, which is a good thing because, like I said, Mickey snagged it and ate it. So, <laughs> go Mickey. She dropped that cheese because it had the pill in it, and Mickey just snagged it quick. And so cheese gone, pill gone, Mickey, Mickey is feeling no pain today. <laughs> oh, Lord, have mercy, the joy of pets. So on that note, I'm going to leave that here, check out the net, see what's coming up. Other than, um, <clears throat> other than Trumpenstein over there freaking out because uh, of all the uh, lawsuits and everything coming up and, and court cases and hemorrhaging money for lawyers and, uh, you know, his good buddy Giuliani, you know, saying he owes him an undisclosed amount of money. You know, he stiffed him. If he's going to stiff Giuliani, get a clue. If you are a businessman and was thinking about working with him, he'll stiff anybody, okay? So uh, on that note, I'm going to leave that here, and we'll see you online.